Did you get him? Yeah, I got the monkey. You got the monkey? Was it a monkey, Alex? It was a gorilla. Oh. Good job. Say Mr. Potato Head. <laughs> what you got? She's saying, I got you cookies. I gotcha. Aw, cookies. Okay, so you guys remember yesterday we were at Target and Alex wasn't with us? The totally, no. totally by chance, she walks up to this thing and says, Look, mom, and does the same exact thing I was doing. How crazy is that? <laughs> totally unprompted so we're just leaving Target and I met a viewer actually Alex and Chelsea and I met a viewer Michael was over in the Star Wars stuff so he missed out uh, I didn't miss out on nothing but I was in Star Wars heaven he was in Star Wars heaven but um, she was real little and her name was Emily and she was with her mom and she said to I guess they were kind of they saw us and then they ended up um, Emily told her mom, we have to go back, I wanna meet them. <laughs> so they came back around and um, came over and said hi. So we thought that was really cool. So, hi Emily. Hi Emily. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you're in the penalty box. It's like sitting in a box. You're in timeout. Oh, yeah. That's the timeout chair, yes. There we go. Wait, let me sit there. Perfect. I don't know if I can this whole out. section is really cool. They've got like pallets and stuff. Oh, yeah, There's soft. pallets above us. It's comfortable, it's just weird. That looks really weird. It's neat though, I like it. Do you know what would happen? Eddie would end up stealing it, or Chelsea yeah. would end up stealing it. Yeah. It'd be like their chair. That's a cool <laughs> chair. It needs one more side and then we can just throw them inside. <laughs> furniture shopping was just too much for her. Too much she, jumping on the furniture. I think this couch is comfy, so she likes this <laughs> one. I think this is the one we should get. <laughs> <laughs> but we probably won't. This is the one we're looking at. It's just very big. It's big. It's, big. it's, so it's soft. Oh, it's a dream to sit on. Comfy. It's so comfy. I love it. It's soft. <laughs> we think we have a winner. We think we're going with this couch, but instead of the chase parts, it's going to be a couch. Gonna, well, it's going to be two Similar. Meet I don't know. I guess I could show you guys on here. Never mind the music and the whatnots. It's going to look like that. Only this color. <laughs> so this is the couch we're looking at right here. We think that's Two hours gonna, later. Two hours or later. <laughs> or who knows? We don't even know. We don't know how long we've been here. So it's not exactly gonna be like this, but it will be this color. It's really soft and comfortable, as you can tell by these two spread out on it. It is. I'm still carrying Chelsea around. <laughs> but we like how it's flat on the back. And it doesn't have the huge gap underneath. Like it's got a gap, but it's not bad. But we think this is the one. Just pick me up and load me in the truck right now. Hey, we could get it delivered tomorrow. <laughs> we just we have, have two other couches. We to have get two rid other of. couches <laughs> to get rid of first. Or we could just have a big couch party. Woohoo! Let's do that. That sounds oh, fun. Oh, Chelsea would love that. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That sounds fun. Do you approve? You like it? <laughs> Done. We're the proud owners of a new couch that we don't well, know when we're gonna get yet. Not yet. <laughs> it's Bas not in our house yet. Basically, they told us we could get it tomorrow, but the problem is, is we have our couches that we need to set up for donation, and they have to come and get them, and we don't know when, and it's a holiday weekend, so. It's gonna be a little tricky, Figures. but let's see. <laughs> the this, weekend we do it's just this one. Go. Everything goes. The weekend we go to do something. Of course, it's a holiday weekend. All right. This is the one we ended up ordering. I tried to show it to you on the sign, and then it's the same color as the one that's in the store. The light brown, I guess it is. And you guys will see it next week. <laughs> Whenever we decide to have them deliver it, we have to call and set that up. But finally, we found a couch. Finally, Mr. Picky Pants. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> we spend yeah. most of our lives on our butts on that couch, so <laughs> <laughs> it better be a good one. And conveniently located right next to the furniture store is the 7-Eleven. So Michael and Alex are going to get, going in to get Slurpees and going to bring one out for Chelsea too. Daddy's going to go get you a treat. 
Yeah, does that sound good? She only just woke up. Oh my goodness, she slept the entire time we were in there. She probably just took like a two hour nap. So that's gonna probably mess up our schedule for tonight, but at least it's Saturday, so it's not like we have anything going on tomorrow. Are you gonna be wide awake now, Missy? Yeah. Slurpee time. Yay. The girls got, or Chelsea got blue flavored. What'd you get, Alex? Um, pink and blue. Pink and the blue? watermelon sour. Sour, I can't breathe. Watermelon, sour, sour watermelon, and what is it, blue raspberry? She mixed them. Mmm, that sounds good. Like mommy, mommy likes blue raspberry. Mmm, is it good? Yeah, you like it? Did you hear? Yeah, I like it, she says. <laughs> good job. That's for having patience with us in the furniture store, even though Chelsea slept the whole time. Oh, she slept. <laughs> I had patience. Alex had patience. <laughs> What'd you find? <laughs> oh, don't poke daddy. Uh, maybe we shouldn't run with sticks. Listen to her laugh. Gonna get you. Go get him, Meg. Go get him, get him, get him. Wow, lost the shoe. Oh my gosh. Yep, that's okay. Well, it would help if you strapped your straps. Big ant pile. Yeah, big ant pile. Chelsea, too close to the ant. Michael, you're gonna hit me. Uh, no, yes. no, no, no. Don't poke the ants. Go, 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 it's fixing the rain. So we had to come run the kids real quick before it starts raining. Oh my gosh. Okay, look out, look out. Ah! <laughs> strap your sandals. <laughs> Guess we need to strap the kicking one. Bad enough you're being a dork and wearing socks with sandals. Look at tiny little what? Acorns. No, that's acorn. Acorn. Yeah, acorn. <laughs> oh, wait there. Thunder, yeah. Where'd the acorn come from? Where'd it come from? Ah, ah there's what the is thing it? that got you. What I don't is know. it? What is it? It's buzzing. Just look at it on me. <laughs> what is it? That's Where'd what it got you. Where'd it go? I don't know. Is it on me? I'll check my no, back. It flew away when you got up. <laughs> That was something. I don't know what it was. Bug it was buzzing. Mommy. Oh my gosh. Look at Tony, Mama. Uh huh. Look at Tony. It's a tiny acorn. Where did you get the acorn from? Where did it come from? Oh, uh, Mama. Uh, mama. It came from a Mama. It came from a Mama tree, huh? Where's yeah. the Mama acorn at? Mama acorn. Where is she? Um. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't know. She's trying to open it. Are you trying to open it? Yeah, I catch the animal. So heavy. So heavy. I don't. I don't think Daddy can get it to open. That's, that yeah, is a tiny. It is so tiny. Uh, if we, oh, oh. We need it's to, loose inside too. We need to find a big one to smash. Well, open. if Daddy opens it, he's gonna break it. <laughs> oh, did, oh. Get you? <laughs> did you get that? No. Aww. It's like, whoa. It doesn't open again. That's as far as it opens. She said, whoa. Whoa. Here's the other piece. You want to put it back together? Yeah. Good. Cool. <laughs> right there. Okay. <laughs> Oh, look at her little fingers trying to fix it. Oh, look at her open. Push. Go. It's in your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it's in the fold of your shirt. Look. Right there. Oh. <laughs> Church? Yeah, it was in your shirt. Oh, uh oh, under. Thunder, yep. Yep, yep, Did you fix it? Yeah, fix it. Is it all better now? Yeah. Oh my goodness. I think <gasps> mommy needs kisses. She's so 
Dinky. <laughs> oh, that was a wet one. Oh, that was a wet one. Oh, it's in my ear. It's in my ear. It's in my ear. <laughs> She's like breathing and kissing and looking at my ear. Kid. Oh, Chelsea. I can't. Ew, and she's all sticky from eating an apple. Oh, no. Oh, no. I can't get her off of me. Give mommy kisses. Oh, I can't. I, Ew, can't. I think that's her nose blowing on you. Ew. Oh, Ew. Are you blowing boogers on mommy? No. <laughs> The scrunch no, nose. No, we've crossed the line. No, I can't do it. It's time for the question of the day. Today's question comes from Rainy Apai. I hope I said that right. And the question is if you had your own TV show, what would it be about? You guys gotta go first. We gotta go first. Alex, you go first. I guess about my life, like a reality show, something like that. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay. Cool. I guess. Is that it? Yeah. I'm like vlogging the playhouse. <laughs> okay, I would say a travel adventure type show where I travel all over and I do all kinds of adventurous things like go to the so, theme parks and ride rides and So kind of like the do, Amazing Race? Um, not so much no, like the like Amazing Race, channel, more like show. uh, who's that guy that does all the crazy stuff? Yeah, I've never oh, shoot. I can't think of his name right now. But he goes and he does like all the eating stuff. No, like the bungee jumping from crazy <sighs> high places and he's kind of goofy. Yeah, I don't know his name. And shoot, he was even like he came to our area and filmed something at this the mud thing. at the mud place that we have. We have like a big mud pit where everybody gathers. I and, don't know his name. Oh, I can't think of his name. I know it. I just can't think of it. It's on Travel Channel, yeah. I think. But I want to be able to travel and like do all the adventurous type things and see and do really cool things. So that's what I would want to do. And then it would probably be funny because I'd be like really scared, but then I'd do it and it would be so fun. So. Toy hunting. Ah. Oh, like the toy hunter like show that guys, used to be on, yeah. Jordan Hembro. I would love to do that. To go to people's houses and find all this awesome stuff still in boxes and. Kind of like a toy picker. Yeah. That would be the awesomest that thing. Would be, so I'll do that with you. I want to actually do that. <laughs> <laughs> I would thought too, like, there's a show similar to this, but like where they um, go garage, they go to garage sales and then they find like treasures. Isn't there a show like Treasure, that? Treasure, what is that called? We were watching it in New York. Were we? The one where they, were oh, they but compete against each other? Yeah, but that's different. Like, Oh. I used to go garage sailing every week, like every Friday, Saturday, sometimes Thursday, sometimes Sunday, and I would just go, and I thought it would be fun to like have someone like follow me around as I search for treasures at garage sales, but some there'd be times when you just wouldn't find anything they worth do, buying. But the, it's like that. It's similar. Like, like what the guy they that do... did the Toy Hunter show, like he did, there's a lot, he had to do a lot just to film right. to get enough stuff for one episode. Right. It's It's a lot of work. But I think either of those would sound good. I'd probably, I, at this point in my life, what did he do? He's wanting to the play. The rain's gone. The storm's gone. Yeah. It stormed all well, evening, and now he's full of energy. So we want to know from you guys, if you had your own TV show, what would it be about? Leave it in the comments below.